casket that Father is holding. This week, our parish tide will go to Fish Food Pantry. Thank you for your gift of treasure. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept all of the offerings we have brought to honor the revealing of your beloved Son, so that the oblation of your faithful may be transformed into the sacrifice of Him, who will, in His compassion, to wash away the sins of the world who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Live up your heart. We will up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For, for in the waters of the Jordan, you revealed with signs and wonders a new baptism, so that through the voice that came down from heaven, we might come to believe in your word dwelling among us. And by the Spirit descending in the likeness of a dove, we might know that Christ, your servant, has been anointed with the oil of gladness, has been and sent to bring the good news to the poor, and so with the powers of heaven, we worship you constantly on earth, and before your majesty, without end, we acclaim.
are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. May holy, therefore, this gift we pray, by sending down your Holy Spirit upon them, like they do fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ at the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Say this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Say this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. <laughs> Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope, and David, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be...